welcome to the 2006 First Robotics Competition in this year's game, Aim High. This year's game is played on a 26 by 54 foot field. Three goal openings are located in each alliance station wall through which your opponents will be able to score. Above each center goal is an illuminated target that is used by the automated vision system to determine range and location of the goals. A platform in front of each alliance station wall is used at the end of the match by robots when they climb upon it and score bonus points. The objective of the game is simple. Shoot, push, or roll balls through any of the three goals at the far end of the field. At the end of the match, you have your three robots on your ramp in front of your alliance station. The match starts with a 10 second autonomous period in which robots will attempt to score using just pre-programmed instructions. Each robot can start with up to 10 balls in their possession. Robots can use the onboard vision system to determine the location of the upper center goal. After computing a trajectory, balls are shot through the goal opening for higher point values. Whichever alliance scores highest during the autonomous period earns a 10 point bonus and their goal is turned off in the next period of the game. At the end of the autonomous period, the human players step forward and take over the controls for the remainder of the game. In this case, the blue alliance robots are on offense and will attempt to score through any of the goals. The red alliance robots will attempt to defend the goals to the best of their ability to keep the blue robots from scoring. Robots can restock their supply of balls by either picking them up from the field surface or receiving them directly from human players. At all times during this period, one robot from the defending alliance must remain at the far end of the field and cannot cross the midfield line. For the next period of the game, the roles are reversed as the offensive alliance goes on defense and vice versa. Thus, every robot will have to have both good offensive and defensive capabilities. Robots will also have to be robust to withstand impacts from other robots and the occasional flying ball. During the final period of the game, both goals are turned back on and both alliances can score. During this last 40 second period, teams will need to keep a careful eye on the clock. They want to score as many points as possible while leaving themselves enough time to get back to their own end of the field and put one, two, or all three robots up on the platform for bonus points. In this match, Red wins the 10 point autonomy bonus. Each alliance gets one point for every ball on a corner goal and three points for every ball on a center goal. Red has all three robots on the platform for a 25 point bonus and wins the match 74 to 70. Good luck and we'll see you at the competition.